Another match week in the Canadian Premier League begins anew from the same sites where we said farewell to match week 12. Lionsgate Bridge that crosses the Burrard Inlets as our welcoming committee to Willoughby Community Park. Vancouver FC, they are at home once again for a very first meeting with the Halifax Wanderers. Introducing you to the teams, we'll begin with Afshvin Gopi's side. He makes three changes. Of course, the notable one in goal with Jeremy Zielinski getting the start. Peli Martinez is back in at center back and Minjay Kwok will get the start. Patrice Geyser will be hoping that these 11 men can at least start that job on the right foot. Back in their 3-5-2 tonight, Callum Watson and Christian Campagna draw into the team back towards Zelensky. CPL fans will have Forge and Atletico Ottawa memories in their mind from those kinds of quick passes back to the keeper. Fernandez leans into Kwok, keeps his balance and now Hendel sprung Philly out of his goal. Had their tails up, these Halifax Wanderers, from the opening whistles of the game, and now a hole to climb out of with plenty of football still to be played. Here's Coimbra, great strength. Fernandez, his cross in for Coimbra, bounces around off the chest of Martinez. Booting the ball away is Cameron, but it's collected by the men in the white shirts. Heading to the post. What a response! Just a replay of Sunday's match. <laughs> An immediate response in Coimbra, as I mentioned earlier, playing in front of family and friends tonight. That goal has to feel oh so sweet on a personal level, but for the team, Will, they just picked themselves up, dusted yep. themselves off, and brand new ballgame. It seems like they need a little bit more composure back there. They're what? under the cosh and on and again. Coimbra, the header from the corner kick, but puts it over the crossbar and out of play. And Try and catch them if it opens. Hey, you shoot? Martinez spun inside oh, it's oh, oh, again. Oh, 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 you oh, can't oh, hit a ball oh, better than that. Massimo oh, twice oh. now. It's one thing to do with uh, the, the players because of injuries and things like that. Right. But the system itself, if everybody's aware of what these cues are, there's good reason to hold it. A mistake from the Vancouver keeper. Here's Farron. A line drive right into the chest of Jeremy Zielinski and Rocco Romeo saying, lad, just take a breath. I was definitely cagey, definitely tense as he bobbles it on the restart and not the team you want to send away, especially Massimo Farron. And he's only 23, Rocco Romeo is wearing the armband tonight in his 50th CPL regular season contest. Here's Tim Mateo into the feet of Martinez, sends that straight in the air. Now it's a duel. Zelensky misses, going to ground and trying to scoop that underneath the feet of the backpedaling and very nervous Vancouver defenders was Teo Colum. Clever from Farron. Omar still barreling forward, sneaks it in behind. Watson was who he wanted to play the ball to, but it was stuck in a sea of boots and Vancouver flipped the script. Kwok gets his service this time to the middle. Plays it across Hundle and can tap Mickey can tap his first for Vancouver. And what a timely moment to get on the board. Unselfish again from Sean Hundle, the leading goal scorer is playing assist man today, Will. You know, they've gotten it forward. They've been, they've been the three at the back for Halifax has left them one on one. This time it's Kwok who's one of the three. Out comes Kintov, laid off. Look, he's way far out of your picture. Kwok comes along. Hundo's just waiting for it. Here comes Kintov. I say this not because I don't think that 
Jeremy Zielinski can handle it, but just the nature of the game, Halifax needs to get more shots toward him. Just like this, how about that from Farron? Tracks it down and makes a very acrobatic play. Watson, this might be one of his best openings in the second half. What can Halifax do? Farron inside the box for Omar. Has a go! Way that's Zielinski again, who makes the catch. Both of the shots on target in this second half have been pretty well on the CIBC logo on his bright green shirt. Tav, this is why we got him. Can Tav, Romeo, and Kwok. It's Mickey. Up and over. And that is a worthy. No, is it? I thought that was in the nets. Oh, so close. The BFC crowd erupted. The side net went. Wow. Seven for Halifax. But the two shots that they put at the Vancouver keeper have not been the most dangerous looking opportunities. Meanwhile, all danger for Vancouver. Halifax pushing for a tie. White's dropped into the back line now. Three center backs. Five across the back. Here's the cross. Monroe! Spins through the channel. A near free header in the six yard box, and he puts it over the bar. Tail Colum. The strikers are having a field day, setting up opportunities tonight. Flying over an orange. We're through the four minutes. Calgary into the box. Romero up first. Madre looking for redemption. Spun wide. Nobody around. And hits the referee. And he's blown for full time. Vancouver have a second win at home and a third on the season. And Jeremy Zielinski has a professional win under his belts in his CPL debut.